It is the final stop for disqualified Kentucky Derby winner Medina Spirit. The thoroughbred's shocking death late last year as a three-year-old saddened the horse racing world. LEX 18's Michael Burke attended today's burial ceremony and has our big story at 530 from Georgetown. It's officially the end of an era as Medina Spirit's ashes were interred here today at Old Friends Farm. We expect so much of these horses and they expect very little from us. Like everyone else associated with thoroughbred racing, Medina Spirit's death at the age of three last November shocked Michael Blowen. Blowen runs Georgetown's Old Friends Farm, which serves as the retirement home to so many past champions. Medina Spirit never reached retirement age, but after his passing, Mr. Blowen knew he belonged here and his owner agreed. Today, the farm welcomed race fans for a short funeral ceremony and Medina Spirit will rest next to other champions like Charismatic and War Emblem. Medina's 2021 Derby win was stripped after the steroid betamethasone was found in his system following the race, but doping was not considered a factor in his death six months later. From our veterinarian, I found out that horses that have heart attacks don't have them the way we have them. I mean, they don't have clogged arteries or anything like that. There's something in their electrical system uh, that stops, mm -hmm. and it just stops it instantly. And uh, I think they're still doing a lot of research on how that happened because he's perfectly healthy, had a great workout, and just, uh, it, it's, it's, a, it's very similar to what happened to Reggie Lewis when he died when he was with the Celtics. And because of that detection of beta-methasone in Medina Spirit's system, trainer Bob Baffert is still in the appellate process of his 90-day suspension. Does that punishment fit the crime? Mr. Blowen, who was also a Boston Globe journalist back in the day, weighs in on that tonight on Evening Edition at 7. In Scott County, Michael Burke, LEX 18 News.